with Key, you get an unbelievably incredible athlete. He's got a great passion for the game. Quick, fast, strong. T-Mac loves the game of football, um, and you see it the way he plays. I'm very excited about him as a leader, as a winner. Um, just a great guy to bring into the program. It's a unique bond for those guys to be able to uh, share the same experiences together um, and, and be able to build up a program um, the same way that they did serve us. From Orange County Youth Football to Friday Night Lights at Servite, and now Saturdays together at Arizona Stadium. Noah Fafita, Kean Burnett, Jacob Manu, and Tedaroa McMillan have been repping the same team since 2017. Let's start at the beginning, when you guys all first met. So Kean, who'd you meet first, and how'd you meet them? I think the first person I met was Noah. I think that, um, my mom had signed me up for some team called the OC Buckeyes. I was looking for uh, just a team to play for, and um, I got in touch with his family and ended up meeting him. He was a quarterback, so I ended up meeting him first. I mean, I'm, me and Noah, we met at uh, a fireworks stand. <laughs> nah, I'm, I'm being for real though. We met at the fireworks stand. Nah, nah I, I ain't me at no fireworks stand. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but uh, yeah, I, I kind of met all these dudes in eighth grade. I just, like everyone else said, just joined the OC Buckeyes. In their senior season of high school ball, Noah's commitment to Arizona came first, followed by Kean, then Manu, and then, in a signing day flip, T-Mac. And you guys got a lot of attention, especially you three, because you were earlier um, with your verbal commitment. What was that like in high school? I saw you guys went on podcasts, you were talking to different beat reporters. Was that pretty cool to see the excitement around you guys coming? Yeah, it was really cool. Uh, I didn't know how much football meant to Tucson. So people following uh, high school kids, um, watching all of our highlights, watching all of our games. We had people tuning into live streams during our games. So uh, the support that we got from Tucson, even in our senior year of high school, um, it was special and it's carried on since we've been here. Uh, I thought it was tight that uh, just uh, as soon as we committed, like a lot of people showed us love, like they'll give us interviews, put us in articles and stuff. So I thought that was cool. Excitement continuously grew around the group throughout the entire season as all four true freshmen took on big roles within the team. What advice do you have for incoming freshmen? Stay focused, uh, come in, be ready to work, and learn your playbook. So I'll just say don't lose sight of your dream. Just have a plan every day. Because uh, if you don't have a plan, uh, the monotony of uh, college schedule really can get to you and kind of throw you off track, you know, end up just drifting over a long period of time. So. Be where your feet are. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> all right, shout out bro, man. I'm going to say be where your feet are. Uh, just have fun and enjoy it. Um, this is really where, at least for most people, this is where you dreamt of being, uh, playing Division One football, um, playing college football on the national stage. So um, just enjoy it, be grateful, 